Okay, now we're going to sketch a compact hatchback, something in the C segment, something like a Ford Focus or a Volkswagen Golf in size. Once again, we're going to draw our main box. We're going to divide up the side into five segments to represent the correct wheelbase and tire diameter. We're going to draw our X's to represent the wheel centers. I'm going to draw through the form so that we have both sides of the box. We're going to line our center axis, draw our major axis for the ellipses, and we're going to draw our wheels. We're going to start to set up our cabin. Being that this is front wheel drive, the A pillar is going to touch down somewhere towards the top of the wheel versus the wheel center. That gives it more of a cab forward silhouette. Front wheel drive cars also have quite a bit more front overhang than rear wheel drive cars. We're going to draw our DLO. And give it some some character lines in order to break up the body mass. As you can see I'm continuously adjusting the wheels as I go in order to improve perspective, proportion, and stance. We're going to draw our spokes. The rocker sits well below the wheel centers, close to the ground. Now we're going to draw our front end. It's going to have a bit of a, a bottom breather look to it with some sinister cat eye headlamps. Something very sporty. This thing could have a powerful turbocharged engine, um, something like an ST or a GTI. As we get more and more confident in the drawing, we begin to darken more and more of the lines. Start to draw our door cuts. That helps us define the body side sections. As you can see, the front door cut is going to be very close to the front wheel, being that this is a front wheel drive car. There you have a sexy, powerful, compact C-segment hatchback.